Hey, what is going on everyone? This is iReviews back with another video and we have amazing news for everyone waiting for a jailbreak on iOS 12. Now, a jailbreak has been released called Rootless Jailbreak by Jake James and it supports A9 devices up to A11 devices on iOS 12 up to iOS 12.1.2. So here is everything that you need to know about this new jailbreak. So this new jailbreak is a rootless jailbreak, which makes it a bit different from all their jailbreaks. But at the main time, you can do everything you want to do. You can go ahead and install tweaks, also install themes as well. These are basically the main things that the average jailbreak user wants to do. Install tweaks and themes on their devices. And you will be able to do that with this rootless jailbreak by Jake James, which is pretty amazing as it is the first jailbreak in a few years that is released for the for firmwares that are currently being signed. So it supports iOS 12.1.1 and 12.1.2, which are currently at the time signed by Apple. So if you have a device on a newer firmware, you can go ahead and basically downgrade them to either one of these two firmwares, which as of today are still being signed and jailbreak them. So this jailbreak has recently been released and it doesn't have CD on it, but it will have in the future a package installer. That's an app that allows you to install tweaks and themes just like Cydia does. So at the moment, you can go ahead and install this jailbreak on your device and jailbreak your device. And you can also manually install tweaks. So yes, tweaks do work even with the current state of this jailbreak. So in the future of this jailbreak, there will be updates which will include a12 devices because currently they are not supported which are the newer iphones and also it will fix preference loader which is this thing that will show you the settings of the tweak on the settings app which is currently not working and also according to jake james it will also contain a package installer that's again an app just like Cydia, basically a Cydia alternative for this rootless jailbreak that allows you to go ahead and install tweaks and themes on your device easily without doing that manually. So to keep you more updated, make sure you go ahead and follow Jake James. I will leave his Twitter right down below in the description of the video. So there you can also learn other stuff like how to manually install these tweaks because he has a tutorial coming up very soon. And of course you will be updated with the latest updates of this rootless jailbreak. So now let me show you guys how you can install this jailbreak on your device. To install the rootless jailbreak on your device, all you gotta do is just go ahead and open ignition.fun. I will leave it linked right down below in the description of the video. Just tap on the second tab right here and go to jailbreaks. And if you scroll down right here, you will find rootless jailbreak. So let's just find it right here. Okay, so there it is at the top, I didn't see it. So just go ahead and click Click get right here and wait here for the pop up and click install and you will have the app installed on your device. Once that's done, what you need to do is just go ahead and trust the app. So let's just wait for it to load. It's installing right now. So just make sure you go to settings, go to general, scroll all the way down here to profiles and device management and make sure you trust it right here. So that way you can use this jailbreak on your device. When you open the app, you will have only one tab right here, which allows you to jailbreak your device as easy as that. But for now, I don't really recommend this because it's pretty hard for the average user to install tweaks manually. Just wait for the update. Hopefully very soon we will have an update of this jailbreak that will contain a package installer as well. And that will make it easier of course for everyone to install tweaks and themes on their devices and of course we need that preference loader fix so that's pretty much it for this video guys thank you for watching very excited to have a jailbreak here for ios 12 with the firmware still being signed so if you want a jailbreak make make sure you get on those firmwares 12.1.1 or 12.1.2 as soon as you can that's it thank you guys for watching i will see you guys on the next one